How you doing Chuck? This is our 74 duster. As you can see the paint is in uh, pretty good condition for a daily driver. So we move down the side here. As we get to the rear you'll notice that the chrome is in excellent condition. And we'll get in here on the rear spoiler. And as we move around the driver's side, you'll see some minor blemishes. There's a small chip in the paint. and another minor chip on the lower portion of the door. Other than that, it seems to be very good. And you can see the paint on the driver's side actually has a very good shine to it. As we move to the front, you can see the chrome on the bumper is in exceptional condition. Headlights are in good order, as is the trim. And from about a foot away, the paint on the hood is in excellent order. There are those few small chips that I told you about earlier. And we'll cover those. Actually, that was the largest one on the front right there. Other than that, some very minor stuff that could probably just go away with a good wet sand. As we move to the roof of the vehicle, you can see it's in great overall condition. The trim around the windshield is in good order. There's a small blemish on top of the roof, and it's right here. It's about the size of my fingernail. Other than that, pretty good. As we move inside, you'll find the stock interior is in exceptionally good condition. As you can see, uh, not a show winner, but um, definitely a solid underside. Suspension looks to be in very good order. No visible leaks. And we'll go up towards the passenger side here. You can see that even the bushings and the sway bar are still in good condition. They're not all cracked. Ball joint boots look to be in good condition as well. As we move down the vehicle, you can see everything in the transmission area looks to be in very good order as well, including the uh, tail shaft mount. You see the exhaust is free of any holes or rust. Looks to be new mufflers installed. No apparent leaks from the rear end. All right, this is the driver's side frame rail. We're going to work our way to the front. And this is the passenger side. We're going to work our way to the rear. You know, a very solid underside. No apparent welds. Doesn't look like anybody's misplaced the jack either.